James was feeling pleased with himself. The inspector had chosen him to take some VIPs to the workstation. Well, of course he chose me. And frankly, why wouldn't he? He was surprised when the fat controller came to see him before he was due to leave. I'm sorry, James, but the station pilot today is out of action. You shall have to- I'll have to get the coaches myself. Don't worry, sir. Not I can manage. quite. Until another tank engine can get here, you shall have to do the shunting. Say what now? <laughs> Running around the yard having to go on dirty sidings with dirty trucks. <laughs> James was finding his versatility put to the test. He clattered around the yard, grumbling dreadfully. The other engines couldn't help but smile when they saw him. Thank you for arranging my coaches, um... <laughs> I say, playing tank engine? I thought tender engines didn't shunt. Really useful engines do. Perhaps you should give it a go. Certainly not. Wouldn't be dignified. The church clock had struck ten before another engine came to relieve James of his duties. Thanks, Jinty. I owe you one. Oh, it would happen on a day like today. Oh, never mind. I'm not too late and I don't look too shabby. James arrived at the carriage shed to find there was no Pullman coach. The only coach were Annie and Clarabelle. Pullman coach. Where's my Pullman coach? Oh, Henry's got it. He's taking the inspector, apparently. But that's my job! Not anymore. Sorry I can't talk, must be off. Can't be late. Cheerio! Blast! Now, if Henry's taken my train, then... You're taking Henry's goods. Super. Ginger's busy catching up with the backlog, so you'll have to... Arrange it yourself. Show how versatile you are. If James had been bad at something the first time, he was awful. Don't dawdle, come on. Finally, the train was ready. Okay, you hodded lot, let's be off. We're late enough already. If this is versatility, it isn't worth it. Right away, green lamp! Come on, 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 Jeez, old James, you're barely letting the coal burn. Just goes up and through your funnel. I'm not slowing down because of that. Work hard. James thundered through Edward Station in fine style. He was puffing hard and determined to make up for lost <laughs> time. How undignified. From platform 2 is the 1423 service down at Bellevue and Lord Ampley At the workstation, Henry had left the VIPs in their coach and run into a siding to take on water. The 1423 service down at Bellevue and Lord Ampley Hello, what's that? Good grief! Is that James? The signalmen were as surprised as Henry. The branch line train had only just left, and they had not reset the junction points. This just isn't my day, is it?
A shunter brought an old crane to remove the wreckage. James was sent on to the big station at the end of the line. Light engine. I'll be honest, I uh, didn't want to stay ill anyway. He was soon enjoying a thorough wash. Oh, how I have longed for this. Finally, my paint will shine and my brass work will gleam. <sighs> Wonderful. Anything interesting, Murdoch? Well, as it happened, yes. Some silly blight had an accident at the workstation with their train. Oh. W w wow! Oh, oh, wow! Uh, <laughs> any any I ideas of, as to who it was? <laughs> well, nobody there told me. I was just picking up the pieces. Mind you, they could have told me and I might not have held. It was so noisy there. Well, that's my signal. Best be off. Toodaloo, James. Goodbye, Murdoch. Phew. I think I got away with that one. <laughs> Oh, I'm in trouble now. It wasn't even my fault. Hello, what's the Pullman still doing there? Something must be wrong. The inspector walked over. Is anything the matter? Yes, it is. And it was hit by a bit of debris. They need to examine him at the works. I need to get these VIPs home, or would you mind? Not at all, sir. Not at all. Do I say? Oh, wonderful! I see that not all of your engines are kept in as diabolical condition as the one that caused that accident earlier. No, 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 certainly not. Uh, inside the coach, please. Of course, this engine looked a little too well looked after, tempered even, probably not done a day's work in its life. <laughs> You'd be surprised, mate. <laughs>